Thursday, May 2nd, and today is a shot day. I, well, a terzepatide shot day. I weighed myself this morning. I was 258.6. I'm wanting to say my last shot day I was 259, not 100% on that. I weighed myself yesterday and I was 257. So it kind of sucks being a little higher than I was yesterday, but officially I am down. So that's good. Um, feelings from it, I am starting to get more uh, bloating depending on what I eat. Like yesterday, a um, few hours before bed, like maybe four, four to five hours before bed, I had a small bowl of honey mustard pretzels and while delicious, I have a feeling that that was a good source of the bloatiness that I had last night. It's not as bad as it was um, prior to me coming off of the trisepatide. So, I mean, that's good. But uh, I think as long as I stick with, again, I think it's the carbohydrate. I, I'm not 100% on that. <clears throat> I've been having salads every day. I just had a salad for breakfast, and I used that uh, that faux Caesar dressing recipe. It was super good. I had chicken on it and some tomatoes. A little bit of, I didn't have a Parmesan or Reggiano, so I had, I had the one that's similar to that. I think maybe it starts with an A. can't recall. It was pretty good, though, and uh, I was watching Ted Lasso. I do have some errands to run today, so I'm doing my video a little bit earlier. I'll go ahead and show you uh, the shot that I took this morning, and we'll go from there. Okay guys, so I just took a shot. I was thinking about going to seven and a half this week, but decided to stay with the five milligrams. <clears throat> Pretty much the reason I decided to go with the five milligrams is because it is a 15 milligram vial and I didn't want to go just like straight to 10. And if I did seven and a half, that'd only leave me with like, you know, two and a half left. So I'll do the five this week. I'll do the five at the next shot, and then I'll be on to my 30 milligram vials. I'll probably stay, I don't know. I'm not quite sure what I'll do if I'll stay at the seven and a half for a whole month just to make it easier to split the vial. Maybe I will, maybe I won't, who knows. Um, I am still doing the Mott's C, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and so I'll be doing that one tomorrow. That's pretty much it. Don't really have any new TV series or anything. Still watching second season. I have one episode left of the second season of Altered Carbon. Still watching Ted Lasso. I kind of am planning a wee bit to um, go see The Fall Guy tomorrow. That one with Ryan Gosling and Emily Blunt. It looks pretty funny. And it's our anniversary, so it'd be kind of nice to do something. We are we were thinking about, well, pretty much our Hawaii trip is kind of like a nod to one of the kids' birthdays and our anniversary, and it just seemed a good time for everything. But it is still kind of nice to do something on the actual day. A lot of times we both just forget about it. Um, I am I'm really bad at remembering the anniversary, our anniversary. And I, I don't keep track of, you know, the, the little things like some people know when they had their first date or their first kiss or first others. I, I don't retain any of that information. So it's, it is, uh, I do remember birthdays, but anniversaries and that kind of thing just doesn't really stick in my head. So I think it'd be fun to see the fall guy. We have this also Korean barbecue place that I wanted to check out. My sister said it was really good. And uh, it's just, when I'm on trisepatide, I don't eat as much, right? Which is a good thing, don't get me wrong. 
But this Korean barbecue place is like an all-you-can-eat type of situation. They bring you the meat and you cook it on a grill, I guess, at your table. Which I've never been to those kind of places before. But it makes more sense money-wise to eat more so you get your money's worth. Especially if you don't have a lot of uh, disposable income. And when I'm on these shots, I eat less. So it only it almost makes it not cost effective, I maybe is the word I'm looking for, to go to those kind of places. So I'm not sure if we'll go out to eat tomorrow or what, but hopefully we'll see the movie. Fingers crossed. We have some other stuff going on, so it might not work out. I have Bunko tonight. I'm excited about that. It's a dice game. I think I've told you guys about it before. Um, I go and play with the ladies. It's, I enjoy the game well enough, but I really like the camaraderie better. So, and I've said so many times now, I would be perfectly fine with it just being like a potluck, like a once a month potluck where we all just bring a dish and then get together and talk because that's my favorite part of it. You can't really talk when you're doing the dice part of it because you're having to count how many, you know, ones or twos or threes, whatever the round is that you're on. And it's, it's super hard to converse with people and keep track of where you are. So, but nobody has uh, said, oh yeah, that's a really good idea. Let's get rid of this Bunko game and let's, you know, do this. So. We'll see. All right, guys, if I have any kind of side effects I'll tell you about so far, basically it's just the bloating that's starting up. Very limited sulfur burps, which, you know, thank heavens, because those are disgusting. But uh, mainly kind of just the bloating. So I think it is what it is. I can only imagine it's going to get worse the more milligrams I end up taking, but at least I'll know what to expect. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.